What's going on guys? It's your friendly neighborhood Godzilla fan, Jurassic Zilla here. And in this video, we are going to be talking about how Gigan, yes, this guy, can actually work in the MonsterVerse. So, let's get right into this video, shall we? Gigan, one of the most unique Godzilla kaijus out there, wants to join in. Yo guys, come on Legendary, put me in the Monsterverse already! But the only thing we've gotten of Gigan so far in the Monsterverse was him in the concept art. All the way back in 2019, for the concept art for Godzilla King of the Monsters, Gigan was technically in it. But he was just a placeholder because they probably didn't know what other kaiju they were going to use for that movie at the time. So they just chose Gigan, as long as Gamera as well, and even Kamunga. So you're probably wondering, how can this guy make his return? So first, let's talk about Gigan himself and his design. This guy is crazy! He's got a bird beak with teeth inside of it. He's got an eye laser. He has claw hands. They can also be chainsaw hands. Chainsaws for hands. He has a flesh body and has armor all over him to make him look like a robot and act like a robot. He can fly. He came from space, outer space. Oh, and did I forget to mention he has a buzzsaw chest? So you're probably wondering, how can someone this crazy possibly be in something like the MonsterVerse? Well, I'm here to tell you why. That's why you're watching this video. So let's rewind all the way back to 2014. In 2014, everything was pretty grounded. You had a basic plot of the military trying to defend their city from giant monsters. Nothing else to it, really. Huh. Well now let's go all the way to Godzilla vs. Kong, where you have these giant metal robots that just exist. You have these portals that go all the way down into the earth, which is a ginormous opening that somehow isn't melting hot, and humans can just walk down there anytime they want and not die. So, you know, a lot has changed since Godzilla 2014, going into Godzilla vs. Kong. So, something like Gigan isn't as crazy when you really think about it. I mean, we already have aliens in the MonsterVerse. I mean, look at Ghidorah. He's something of an alien himself. So something like Gigan joining the MonsterVerse wouldn't be too insane because he is also an alien. So you can just have this thing where Gigan came down millions of years ago, kind of like how Ghidorah did, and instead of getting trapped in ice, he got stuck in rubble and was deactivated since he's a robot. So then maybe when the humans and Kong are exploring the Hollow Earth, since Kong is the new king of the Hollow Earth, he goes down, find this cave, and he sees Gigan there buried in rubble, kind of like how he was in Godzilla Final Wars. Let's be 100% honest, Kong wouldn't be the one to awaken Gigan. It would definitely most likely be humans because they love messing with stuff they shouldn't. At the very end of Godzilla vs. Kong, we see that humans already have a base down in the Hollow Earth. So there's already humans roaming around all in the Hollow Earth doing their thing. So it wouldn't be too surprising if a group of humans are just exploring the whole entire place and find Gigan buried under there. And all it takes is one simple mistake for Gigan to awaken. Gigan! Rise! Maybe something like the Exilians or some sort of alien race sent Gigan down to Earth and waited for the right time to awaken him to try to take over the world. I mean, I feel like something like an alien invasion could actually work in the MonsterVerse. All you have to do is have these aliens send down Gigan, like maybe even millions of years ago if they wanted to, and just wait for the perfect time to awaken him and try to take over the world. And then Godzilla and Kong just have to stop Gigan. Maybe even some of the aliens come down from space. I mean, they don't have to look like humans like in the older movies. They can always just look, I don't know, different. 
So, what would this fight look like between Godzilla, Gigan, and Kong? Well, first of all, Kong might not be the best matchup for Gigan. Kong isn't made to be fighting all these really sharp robot creatures. He did well with Mechagodzilla, sure, and maybe Kong can get his axe and maybe hit Gigan. Maybe it could be something like Final Wars, how Godzilla just shot his atomic breath, blew off Gigan's head. But I doubt they would do that. I feel like if Godzilla shot his atomic breath, it wouldn't just blow off his head, he would just get hurt. And I just feel like Gigan is such a perfect enemy for Godzilla. The only time we've ever seen Godzilla really bleed a lot by getting sliced up in the MonsterVerse was back in 2014 with the Mutos fighting him, and in Godzilla vs. Kong when Kong sliced him in the leg with his axe. So if you just have a whole movie about this Godzilla and Kong trying to fight this mechanized titan, but it's nothing like Mechagodzilla at all. It is completely different. It's not like you can get his axe and just chop off an arm. It's not going to work, because you got to get close to Gigan in order to do that, and also he's got these giant hooks for hands. Oh, and did I forget to mention, he's got a buzzsaw chest. I will say one thing though, if Gigan were to make his return, I feel like you should do it in a later movie. Maybe not this next movie coming out in 2024, I feel like maybe it could even be the movie after that if you wanted to. Something like Kong isn't really a good matchup for Gigan. So I feel like if you just have a Godzilla vs. Gigan movie, that would do a lot better. And also, it's a good way to bring in and Gears back. Since in 1972, Godzilla vs. Gigan and Gears was also there to help Godzilla. So I feel like that would be really awesome to have Godzilla and M. Gears fight off um, Gigan. Maybe even bring Rodan in there if you wanted to, and some other kaiju if you want. Maybe Behemoth. Who knows? But I feel like something like that could do a lot better than Godzilla and Kong teaming up to fight Gigan. So I feel like the whole lesson of this video is that Gigan is cool. That's it. No, but seriously, I really think Gigan could definitely work in the MonsterVerse. But personally, I think for this next movie coming out in 2024, I think they'll use a new kaiju. Kind of like how they did with the Mutos in 2014, or how they did with the Skullcrawlers in Kong Skull Island. Or Doug in Godzilla vs. Kong! I just wanted to show Gigan some love because I feel like he really deserves it. If we ever do see Gigan in the MonsterVerse, maybe in the next like 5 years or something, that would be so awesome, I'd be so hyped to see him and to see what changes they make to him. But if we never see him, that's fine too. Although I really want Gigan to be in the MonsterVerse. So that's it, hashtag Team Gigan, and I really hope to see this guy again one day. Oh my god, I just said guy again, like I hope to see this guy again, and his name is Guy. Okay, I'm done. I I'm done. Hey, make sure to subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. And if you like the video, it tells me that all of you guys really like this video, more than probably some of my other videos. Because this is kind of a new type of video topic that I've been doing. So if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Comment in the comment section below what you think about Gigan and do you think we'll ever see him in the MonsterVerse one day? I personally think we definitely will, but who knows? It's up to the director to decide. Anyways, have a great Godzilla day. Bye. Also, did I forget to mention that Gigan has a buff saw chest?